All right, well, it's time for another weekly Squirtle. We are on weekly Squirtle number 50. And I don't believe I've missed a single weekly Squirtle. Um, I did the first one when it came out. In fact, if I remember correctly, I think the creator of the game actually sent me uh, a bonus weekly to do before the first weekly one actually came out. So I've done all of the weekly Squirtles, including an extra one. Plus I've done a few bonus ones uh, that I got through their Patreon system um, that they sent me uh, I, I for free to test out. Anyways, it doesn't matter. The point is, <laughs> <laughs> I've done all of the weekly Squirtles that we've had, and we're on number 50, so that's pretty crazy. We're almost at a year of weekly Squirtles. So, if you're not familiar with Squirtle, you probably don't know what I'm talking about, and I just keep saying weekly Squirtle, weekly Squirtle, weekly Squirtle. It doesn't sound like a word anymore. But Squirtle is like Wordle, uh, but on a grid, and we're guessing a row and a column at the same time, and then we move to the next row and column, and this eight is how many guesses we have remaining, and we get a bonus guess if we complete a word. So... Um, let's, let's start, we're on 50, let's start with 50. It's weekly Squirtle number 50, why not? Terrible start, sure, yeah, why not? Uh, so, um, we obviously want to do some different letters now, I mean, we do have an I in the column, not in the row, so we could do an I somewhere, but other than that, let's do some new, let's do, let's do laugh, let's just do five new letters. Ooh, okay, well, the A was good, the U and G, not so much. Um, okay, so there's an L and a T there. Now, we really don't know anything about this third row and column other than what we don't have. So, let's go for some new letters again. How about snore? That's all new letter. Okay, good. The E was good. We still don't have much. We do have, you know, the red and the yellow S, so this could be an S here, but not necessarily. Um... And there's an N. Okay, there's an N in the second column. Uh, unfortunately, the white N is where the green is, so it's they're ruling out the same one. So oh, we could have an N up there. Yeah, hard to say. Uh, we have we do have a T in the fourth row here. We're on the fourth one. We, again, we don't have much. We have a T somewhere in the fourth row. Uh, it might be good to do. I don't know. I don't know, where's a good spot to try the T? Could be almost anywhere at this point. Is the problem. I do like starting with S here and putting a T there. That's pretty good. And then we need to have an L somewhere, but... Let's try something that starts with L. And maybe has a T at the end, possibly? To check for another spot for the L over here. Um, what about an I second? We do have an I somewhere. It could be AI, though. AI is pretty good. So maybe not there, but it could be. If it was AI, what would this be? Can't be Cairn, there's no R. The problem is, if this is L, it's probably got a vowel after it. Which wouldn't fit with the AI, but... I mean... At this point, there's a lot of things that could happen. Uh, so... You know... Let's, let's think about this. This could be A-I-N. We do have an I and an N. And that's pretty good. A-I-N is pretty good. In which case, this is probably a vowel. It'd be an O, and we could do like stool. No, that can't be, that can't be an O. So if this was a vowel, we probably need to have a double vowel. Hmm. Maybe A-I? But then we'd have to have the L still. That doesn't really work. Hmm. I like the I N, but it doesn't work very well. Cause okay, S T. If it's S T, we still don't even know it's S T. There's so many unknowns here. All right, let's let's just do let's do L I something. What would be L I and end at a T? I mean, we could do limit, which would really check for the eyes. So 
something like light wouldn't be too bad if we didn't already know there was no G. You know what? <clears throat> Instead of putting the T there, let's do this. Let's do live because we've got the white H. So we know there's an H in the grid. It's not in the second or fifth row or column. This will check the fourth. Ooh, maybe we want to do actually I changed my mind. Okay, we know the H is in the grid, not in the second or fifth row or column. So let's check the first or third, because we're checking the fourth right now by putting it in the fourth row and column. So let's try and locate the H. Maybe that'll help. We do have the T across here. So what if we did like TH, something like that? Uh, who has to say other, but we know there's no R. Yeah, I like the TH there though, because that puts TH here as well, and lets us, you know, potentially rule out this location as a T for the first column, if this is, or, or confirm that there could be a T there. But what are we gonna do? We don't want to do other. We could do, we could do ethic? Ethic isn't terrible. We haven't checked a C yet. Or ethos. Ooh, do we want to do an O? Or an I here. I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna do ethos. I think it'd be good to check for S's in the last row and column as well. Okay. Well. Okay. <laughs> So, the yellow T means that this could be T here. So this could be ST. We have an E, T, and H in that row. The T can't be first, second, or fourth. The H, so, so maybe it's TH like this. Because we do have the red and the yellow H here. So TH like that would be good. The E could be at the end. Uh, something like lathe. We have the L over there. Or lithe, we have we have the the I too. Lithe is good. Lithe is good. T up there, the H here. There's an O. The O could be. I mean, it's probably not E O, right? And the O can't be third. So the O is first or second, probably. There isn't too bad. T A something. What would that be? Hmm, okay, well I'm thinking lithe across there is pretty good. This would be, ooh, but then what's this gonna be at the end here? After the L, because it can't be an E, because of the yellow E there. So it can't be like stale or something. Uh, stock? It's possible. And then, yeah, because look, we have the red N, we could do KN. Ooh, that would be really good. Something like Nelt? Nelt isn't bad. Man, I'm tempted to just try that. Just go wild. Even though K isn't a very good letter. What would this be over here then? That's the question. If it ends in ET. Uh, I mean, it could be something like Comet, I guess. Yeah, actually. You could do taboo and abate. It's not too bad. What's gonna come what's gonna be across here though? A something, A something, M. Uh alarm. No, there's no R. Oh, I was gonna say alarm, but there's no R. Yeah, this HL isn't looking very good here, is it? Okay, hold on. Let's back up. I got a little crazy there with my wild guessing. The HL here is a problem. So Nelt maybe doesn't work. I do like the KN though. Oh, what if we did Mocha and Need and ED over here? That's better, that's better. Need and Mocha. 
Well, this could still be taboo, potentially. And a bait? And a back, if we had another K? I mean, why not? Let's go wild. Cabin, scamp, and poked. There's no way all those are right, is there? Wow, if I figured them all out just from that, that's crazy. Just basically from lithe, which came from the T, H, and E. <laughs> I mean, and we had the red L and the red I. Um, I, I think I like these. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go, um, let's do poked. Let's just go wild and go for poked. Yes! Yes! Alright, okay. Uh, stock? Um, cabin? No way. Wow! Yes! <laughs> wow! I've, I mean, I've had some grids that I figured out from very little information before, but I feel like that was, that was up there on the, uh, in the, the list of grids I've figured out from very little information before. Wow. I don't know, maybe, maybe not. Maybe it was more obvious than I think it was, but you know, the T, uh, the Lithe, right? The T, H, and E, and we were somewhat limited on the T and the H, we had the red and the yellow, and so that, and the I and the L over here, so it kind of made sense. And then from there, that H in the fourth spot really limited things. There's not that many words you can do with an H fourth, I don't think. And once I thought of the KN, you know, KNE, there's not that many options, so it just, those two and then everything else just sort of fell together from there, I guess, so. Wow, all right, anyways, um, I was feeling like we weren't getting much information and then all of a sudden we had it all, so I guess that's the way these puzzles usually go, so. Scamp, taboo, aback, lithe, need, stock, cabin, abate, mocha, and poked. There you go. All right, well, let me know how this weekly squirtle went for you and which word you had the hardest time with, um, and if you are also surprised that we're already on week number 50 of the weekly squirtle. And be sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you again soon with some more puzzles. In the next inning, he was on deck when the manager informed him he had just been traded to the Montreal Expos. Now, the Expos oh, had a oh, game oh. later that evening. Replacement. I was just thinking about words that could end with M-E-N-T. Oh, it's not shall. So one of the L's has to be the lie. So feel or feeling, I think feeling, because I think it's gonna be develop, or maybe develops with the S there. 